Wish volunteer Kat Coker has stepped up for some of the toughest cases. Now Make a Wish and the Red Cross are helping her with her wish. She's worked so hard to help other families and kids deal with leukemia and for her to get leukemia is um, it's a hard blow for all of us. For 13 years, Kat Coker of Southwest Portland has volunteered with Make-A-Wish. She's just got a huge heart. Often taking on cases where the child may have little time left. And so being able to kind of remain upbeat and remain positive and remain magical in the middle of that situation is, is a hard job. With that same strength and spirit, Kat is now in a fight of her own against cancer. She was diagnosed with a severe form of leukemia in May. She has done so much for so many. I just said, what can we do to help support you? Kat's answer? Donate blood, something she's also done her entire adult life. It can be risky for Kat's health to be around a lot of people right now, so I spoke with her by phone about her wish for people to give blood. I knew that I was going to start taking more than I had ever even donated in my, in my adult lifetime, so I wanted to be able to show or replace that um, at the very least and um, hopefully inspire others to uh, you know, kind of take that baton and, and, and give to the American Red Cross. So today, Make-A-Wish Oregon hosted a blood drive, and I found out it couldn't come at a better time. Summer tends to be a slower time for donations nationwide. We're experiencing a, a, a shortage, um, and we definitely do not want to be in a scenario where someone's not a, the, the blood isn't available in an emergency situation. For Kat, this is a wish come true. For her friends with Make-A-Wish, it's really a way to give back to someone who's given to so many others. In Southwest Portland, Amy Frazier, Coin6 News. Ordinary people, I always say, doing extraordinary things, and we just don't do enough of those stories. No. We really don't. The Red Cross says there's a critical need for blood right now. We posted a link to that and some upcoming blood drives, depending on your zip code, and you can check that out at coin.com. Hey, do you have a news tip that you'd like us to know about? You can always email it. It's pretty easy to report it at coin.com, or just click the report it tab right there on our mobile app.